Hi, this is how to print separators on a different printer tray with Batch and Print Premium Law Edition. So I'm going to drag and drop some files to print into the main interface. So normally they will print on whatever the printer setup is. So I'm going to be tray one. But what I want to do is print separators before each on tray two. So I'm going to click on Options menu, Separator Banner Pay Setup. Click Generate Separator File on the fly. Now this basically populates the information into the RTF file before printing. So it'd be like a file name information, for example. I'm gonna click on Browse. I'm gonna select, I'm gonna select a different template, just a file name and file title. And in here, I wanna click Browse. And this is where the tray is set. So if you go to Examples, so that's the path you need to look for. I'm just going to select tray 2. Now this name has to be exactly the same name as on your printer. So some printers are named trays, some are printers are named like cassette or bin. So you need to have files that are exactly the same name. These files are just blank files that can be anywhere. You can create them yourselves in Notepad as long as they've got the TRA extension. So click tray 2. So that's now set up, ready to go. Save and exit. Click print. So the separator has been generated and it's going to be printed on tray two. It's there. So this software we've got here is Spooku Viewer Plus Plus. And this actually shows more information about the print before it actually prints out. So I can see that the separator is on tray two and then it's on tray one, tray two, or tray one. So if I click on the separator, I can see that it's generated this information, which is from the file afterwards on PDF. And then the next separator will have the two dot doc from the Word document. And that will print on tray two. And it's that simple to set up, give it a try.